All right, so it's finally here, everyone, and we kind of been talking about this for quite some time. And on previous of my videos, that I knew an Ultron was eventually going to be coming, ever since we got the um, Ultron from Build Divers. And I'm sure you guys see the videos that the runner actually has an Ultron Gundam runner specifically. So here we are, guys. It's finally here, and of course, it's P Bandai. So I'm not too surprised that's from P Bandai. But at the same time, at this point, I feel like P Bandai is like the way to go to buy merch or kits now. So it's, you know, I'm still going to get it. I mean, it's an Ultron Gundam. It's freaking sick, right? So uh, it looks like this will be coming out in October 2024. And as you can see, it's looking really, really nice. So some of the photos we have here, of course, is uploaded by Gunpla Nerd. And of course, if you see some on Twitter already. But it's really, really nice. And. Of course, you can see a lot of the frames from the Shenlong. You can see from there. And the dragon arms are just really nice right here. And it's really thick. Like, it's really thick and badass. The shield and everything. Um, of course, it has the dragon. And the one thing I really liked about the Ultron gun was the dragon tail right here. It had the dragon tail blasters with the wings. Really, really iconic for sure. And when I watched, you know, Gundam Wing a long time ago, this was the one I really liked really really like this one um of course it has the of course the saber right there um the posing looks really good it's really on point and i did build the shenlong too and that was actually a really nice build uh, of course again the dragon arms are really really like on point so looking at these images right here this is looking really really nice and of course again some better images there so this looks kind of good um, this one was a kind of a blurry photo, but this one is like way more clear. And I like guess again, the dragon arms are just really unique. And of course, this is kind of like the one from the, uh, Shenlong. So instead of one, it's just two dragon arms, basically for the most part. Um, the body is pretty much the same here. The legs are a little more thicker compared to Shenlong, of course, but obviously the wings are really pretty much standing out. Um, of course with the twin sabers right here iconic weapon and it doesn't like there's anything else to come up with it but again like the, the the twin blasters right here on top is just uh is definitely something iconic right there and of course there's an image with uh, both dragon arms extended and yeah nope it's pretty solid it's looking really really good so the good thing about this one is that it has the dragon arms um, like away from the hands because I think the Shenlong has the, the arms or the hand inside the dragon mouth But this one doesn't so that's kind of what's cool about this one Has like that power fist and of course it says what it comes with you see the um, I don't know what we call this scythe I guess um, With four different hands and I think these are the dragon arm extensions. So this is what extends the dragon arms It looks like it's really cool um, but yeah, no, overall, this is really, really exciting news for us Gundam fans, especially if you're a Gundam Wing fan. This is definitely something, you know, you definitely want to check out. So let me know what you guys' thoughts are. Um, are you guys excited for this? Make sure you comment below. What are your thoughts? And tell me if you're excited. And see you guys next video. Peace. Hey, I was watching that.